Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received this wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. With humble spirit and contrite heart, may we be accepted by you, Lord. May our sacrifice in your sight today be pleasing to you, Lord our God. Wash us, Lord, from our iniquity. Cleanse us from our sin. Pray, my sisters, my brothers, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for all good and the good of all his holy church. Receive, O Lord, the offerings of our devotion and grant that we who celebrate your son's work of boundless charity may, through the example of the Blessed Virgin Mary, be confirmed in love of you and of our neighbor, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, and to praise, bless, glorify your name as we celebrate the ever-blessed Virgin Mary. For by the overshadowing of the Holy Spirit, she conceived your only begotten Son. And without losing the glory of virginity, brought forth into the world the eternal light, Jesus Christ, our Lord and God. Through him, the angels praise your majesty. Dominions adore and powers tremble before you. Heaven and the virtues of heaven and the blessed seraphim worship together with exaltation. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs in humble praise as we are claimed. Holy, 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 Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, a font of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Holy Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ at the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and, giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this all of you and eat of it for this is my body which will be given up for you in a similar way when supper was ended he took the chalice and once more giving thanks he gave the chalice to his disciples saying, take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, and for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us 
worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world. Bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope and Jason, our Bishop, all the religious, the clergy, and your entire people. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection. And we lift up to the Lord, Sylvia Matthew. And all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. My dear friends, let us now call to God our Father. Let us thank the Lord for sending his Son, who will come wherever we are to find us and to save us and to bring us home into the Father's house. So let us there say, Our oh, Father, who art, art in, in heaven, heaven. hallowed be thy name. Thy, name. thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy will, will be done on earth, earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our day daily bread, bread and, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as, as we forgive, forgive those who trespass against, against us. And lead us not in the temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the, the kingdom, kingdom the, the power, power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give to you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your holy will, who we'll live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your Move spirit. by God's love, let us share with one another God's peace. The peace of Christ. Lamb of God, you, you take, take away, away the, the sins, sins of the world. world. Have mercy on us. Lamb, Lamb of God, you, you take, take away the, the sins, sins of the world. world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. My sisters, my brothers, behold Jesus. Behold the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ be for us a healing remedy and keep us safe for eternal life. Amen.
Lord, prepare me to be a sanctuary, pure and holy, tried and true, with thanksgiving, I'll be a Let us, dear friends, make the act of spiritual communion, my Lord Jesus. We believe that you're truly present in the most holy sacrament. You're present, dear Lord, because you want to love us. You want to come to us, Lord, wherever you find us, in order to love us and to raise us up, to make us your very own. Lord Jesus, we love you above all things. And we desire to receive into our hearts and souls and minds but, Lord, we cannot receive you at this moment sacramentally. We beg you, Lord, come to us in a spiritual manner. Come, Lord, and live inside of our hearts, our souls, and our minds, that we might think with you and love with you and do God's will with you. Thank you, Jesus, for your great embrace. Help us by your grace to embrace in return and unite ourselves wholly and completely to you. And never permit us to be separated from you. Amen. Please stand for the Benedictus. Store up treasure for yourselves in heaven where there is no moth and no rust to spoil it. Blessed, Blessed be, the be the Lord, Lord the God, the God of, Israel. of Israel. 
He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior in the house of David, his servant, as he promised by the lips of holy ones those who were his prophets from of old. A Savior who would free us from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us, so his love for our fathers is fulfilled and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father to grant us that free from fear and safe from the hands of our foes, we might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him. To make known to his people a their salvation through forgiveness of all of their sins. The loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Store up treasure for yourselves, for yourselves in heaven, where there is no moth and no rust to spoil it. Let us pray. Grant to your church, O Lord our God, that strengthened by the power of this sacrament, she may eagerly walk in the pathways of the gospel until she reaches the blessed vision of peace, which the Virgin Mary, your lowliest handmaid, already enjoys eternally in glory through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with yes. your spirit. And may God Almighty bless you and keep you the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us go in peace glorifying the Lord with our lives. Thanks, Thanks be to God. And have a wonderful day my beloved friends. Same to you Father. Number 163 163 Mother of God Mother of God, we hear thy heart thrown in the azure skies. While far and wide within its charm, the whole creation lies. O oh, sinless heart, all hail, God's dear delight. That it might wider be. That it.